Our next take for today is 5.6C, and 5.6C is just light energy. It has its own teak because it's very special. So light energy is energy that can be sensed with the eye, okay? Um, light travels in straight lines, and light energy, I'm looking at your chart here, uh, the light that you see in the classrooms and at home, that's called artificial light. And then the light you see outside from Mr. Sunshine, that's your natural light. All right, so when you're dealing with light energy, Light travels in those straight lines, like we said, until it hits something, until it comes into contact with something. And when it does that, it can do one of two things. Actually, three things. The first one is it can bend, and we call that refraction. Okay? So light's coming down from the sun. It's hitting this nice pool on a hot July day, and you're in there swimming. And all of a sudden, when light hits the water, it bends. So it makes you... If you're in the water standing there and I'm standing above on the ground looking down, your body does not, this part of your body does not look lined up with this top. It's off just a little bit looking. It also will appear to look even a little larger than it actually is. That's because of a wonderful trick called refraction. The second way light starts traveling is when it hits an object, especially a real shiny object it reflects. It comes right back at me. Oh my gosh, I cannot see. So if I'm outside and I'm trying to look at my little mirror and put my lipstick on or mess with my mascara and I turn it just right and the sun hits it, boom, it's gonna boink me in the eye and just blind me, okay? And so that's reflection. Also, whenever you're just in your room and you're in your mirror trying to look good because you're about to make it musically, that's reflection too. All right, and then the last one, when light travels and it hits an object, like definitely a black wall or a black chair, it just absorbs it. It doesn't go anywhere. It can't pass through it. It doesn't reflect back, and it definitely doesn't refract, okay? It just absorbs it. So then you've, let's talk about prisms. So when white light comes and hits a prism, boom, the other side, rainbow colors come out, okay? And it's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful rainbow colors. Uh, let's talk about real quick, um, whenever we're shining lights, like a pointer, okay? If I shine it straight and it hits an object, it's going to come right back to me straight. If I hold it at an angle, it's going to reflect back at an angle. All right? So remember that if you see those kinds of questions. And I think that's about it.